Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hope you're doing all well. Um, it's been a long time since I've sat down and filmed a video, let alone uploaded a video. I don't know why, I've just been so lazy in that department. But today I made a conscious effort to film a video. So here we are. Um, so during Black Friday, I made, during the Black Friday sales, I made my first uh, Sephora purchase, yay. Um, as you know, or may know, Sephora um, is coming to the, to the UK, well, it has come to the UK, Feel Unique have been bought um, by Sephora, so the whole website is now known as Sephora. And um, I heard that they are opening a store sometime around um, spring next year. So that's very exciting. However, I must say I'm not too excited that we have Sephora now in the UK. I mean, I mean, yeah, it's been too long of a wait. But, you know, if it was like five, six years ago, then it would have been game on, you know. Um, now that we can, we have access to so many, um, you know, American brands, not just American brands, but so many brands in general, like, it's not as exciting anymore. I don't know. Um, but I'm still happy that they have finally come to the UK. They should have come years ago, you know, like, hello, it's UK, you know, like, if we don't have Sephora in the UK, then what is even the point? But, um, yeah, so we have Sephora now. Anyway, um, so I'm just going to get started on what I bought. I didn't go too crazy. I only got the things that I really, like, wanted um, or which were on my wish list. I didn't want to get, you know, just... A bunch of stuff just because it was like Black Friday sales I think what we tend to do is we we do unnecessary shopping um, just because it's Black Friday whereas if we be like a little bit more smart and pick the things that we actually want or which is actually on our radar that's when it's worth it so as you know I've been uh, collecting a lot of high-end perfumes this year, so I waited for these uh, Black Friday sales, and I saw Feel Unique were having this promotion where if you spend two hundred pounds, you got a free goodie bag where. Three, four hundred pounds something like that so obviously I had to take the advantage of that offer yes it's 200 pounds in one go but you know I'm not gonna I didn't pay it all at one go I'm gonna pay it bit by bit I used Clarana I'm quite sensible with that I don't know like I don't want to promote um, you know um, like credit cards and you know um buy now pay later i um thankfully i i, I am careful with things like that and anyway we, we don't need to get into that you know that that's that's personal but um yeah if i was going to get the question is if i was going to get those perfumes it would have to be on a discount or a deal like that um or the moral of the story is if i were to get these high-end luxury perfume there would have to be something in return for me okay <laughs> um so the first perfume i got was the alien moogler it's the other perfume in 30 mils i only got 30 mils i feel like 30 mils is enough for me like uh, if you but if I bought like 50 mils or 70 mils you know like 
perfumes then come up to like 80 90 pounds and i didn't want to spend you know that much money on one perfume so i got the 30 mils so yeah i really really love this perfume i had sa uh, samples and samples of this and i love it and finally um i have it i'm not going to open it because i'm going to do a separate unboxing of each of these perfumes so that's the first perfume i then got um gosh this is my second chanel perfume i only have one chanel perfume which is chanel coco mademoiselle i bought years ago like i'm t i'm talking uh, more than a decade ago like i still have it and i use it bit by bit because it's so expensive um but i saw this and uh and it was can't remember how much it was but it's um 25 mils they you know would have been wonderful if it was 30 mils but it is what it is it's 25 mils and i think this was around 40 to 50 pounds or maybe six, 50 to 60 pound mark um so yeah again i'm going to do a separate unboxing and the last did i get any any more perfumes no so i got two perfumes and then I picked up two foundation, which I have, one of them I have been wanting for a very long time, but have didn't have the guts to buy it because it is a very expensive uh, foundation. And I kind of waited for a sale like this where I could, um, you know, pick it up and sort of justify, you know. And it's the Dior Forever uh 24 hour matte foundation i believe in the shade 4w warm um i did look up swatches and reviews and you know and i kind of just went with that so i think this is a pretty good match i like my foundations to be like on the warmer side slash yellow warm slash yellow um cool tones looks really off on me just i just don't enjoy um you know like cool tone fair like i like my foundation like the deeper the better obviously not too deep and you know i like a warm look I hope i'm making sense so this is it oh my gosh such a gorgeous bottle and i've never ever tried anything from dior have i no, I, that's a lie actually. I did have a Dior perfume, the Dior Hypnotic Poison perfume, which I absolutely loved, but I, you know, and I was planning to purchase it on this, this particular purchase, but um, they didn't have it in, like they had it in the, they didn't have it in the perfume version. They only had it in the other toilet, other toilet. Anyway, so, yeah so i finally picked the dior foundation up and at some point i will be picking up the other one which is um uh it's you know the mac face and body foundation it's kind of in that sort of version and yeah um i will pick it up at some point so excited this oh gosh this is around 40 pounds you know I know that's crazy for a foundation that is beyond, you know, that is literally bonkers. Um, but it is Dior and I would never purchase this perfume on its own if I didn't get it in this deal. Yeah. Anyway, um, another foundation which have been... Uh, you know uh, on my list and it's a brand it's a new brand and everyone's raving about it and talking about it and it's the rare beauty by selena gomez it's her line basically her brand and this is the liquid touch weightless foundation and my shade is 34 36 ow w for um warm and this wasn't too expensive i mean for a high-end foundation it was 
26 pounds I believe and the packaging is so like I've never seen a makeup a any makeup brands come out with you know this kind of packaging is quite quite different quite clean I don't know reminds me of Fenty Beauty kind of um, anyway and this was 26 pounds but yeah I got it I mean I could have picked it up in in another like separately um, because it wasn't that expensive but I had to make up 200 pounds so yeah so then I picked that up and what else um Okay, so um, the next two things I picked up, I picked up a blush from Huda Beauty. This is her Glowish blush, Glowish by Huda Beauty, and it's the Cheeky Vegan blush in 02 Caring Coral. Um, again, very raved about on the beauty community. Uh, um, in the beauty community right now and this is it again I feel like very clean very um, just clean and uh, you know not over the top I think most a lot of brands are going for that clean look like that clean packaging I hope I'm making sense but you know it's, it's yeah so I picked up uh oh oh well so that's the blush i picked up and i picked up this um rimmel although i there was no need for me to pick up rimmel um from sephora because you know we can get rimmel uh, in the drug stores um but you know um because i i had like few pounds like three or four pounds left to my 200 i didn't want to go over 200 i wanted to stay within 200 so for me that's like for me it was like the, the best deal i could get so i then picked this rimmel kind to free um powder in 020 light now it is light for me unfortunately but it was there for like three pounds something and i initially wanted to get the foundation but they didn't have it in my shade so I got this so yeah I hope it works anyway so that is oh um another two more items actually um so um I had 10 pounds I believe was it 10 pounds yeah I had 10 pounds worth of points uh or, or 10 pounds worth of uh gosh I can't talk reward points on my feel unique but because feel unique have been bought by Sephora um the points are still there so I didn't lose out on my points just because they've been bought by another brand so I chose to spend my 10 pounds on um first of all the liquid touch brightening concealer from uh, rare beauty i thought since i'm picking up the foundation i might as well get the concealer as well and this is in the shade m 6 bs i don't know but um it is a uh, yeah i can definitely maybe i would have gone a shade um up but um, I just wanted to be like safe and I don't I only I use um, concealer to highlight my under eye rather than concealing um, that's why I wanted to be safe and pick up a lighter shade than what I could have gotten and still would have worked but oh well that's the thing when you um, when you buy things or when you buy makeup from uh, online <laughs> And then the last thing I picked up was um, the e.l.f. Putty Bronzer. Um, again, um, all the e.l.f. Putty products, like we all know, 
the putty primer is loved by the beauty community and they have come out with pl putty blushes putty pl bronzers since then so i picked up the bronzer and i yeah it's um oh yeah anyway sorry guys i haven't filmed a video in so long that i feel like I'm, my mouth is so drying right now and finally what i got with my purchase uh the free um gift were three four hundred pounds um I'm, I'm not gonna show all of it but i got a lms product um, i got this bondi boost hair protect spray um i got First of all, can we appreciate this bag? Like, they could have totally put this in a, like, one of those, you know, like, um, you know, like those tote bags, you know, like, um, they didn't, there was no need for them to give me a, you know, like a, a nice bag, but yeah, I'm really happy, um, and yeah, so this is the products I've got. Sorry guys, I'm rushing because um, I need to pick up my son as well from school. So these are all the products I've got and all of this. And yeah, um, and I really love the bag, like so pretty. Like usually um, they tend to give you in those like, um, you know, like those um, bags, like those cotton material type tote bags um yeah but i'm so happy that they gave them a, a, a bag which i can actually use and these days i do tend to travel a lot fly a lot so this will become so handy and i was i've been wanting to purchase a makeup bag like this but now i don't have to because i have these okay my friends and two more items which are not from sephora but i thought i'll include it anyways because it's just two items and it's pointless for me to do a video um on two items so the other day i was in tk max and i saw i came across this uh, kit best in cream complexion and uh it's the bella pierre from the brand bella pierre I've heard of Bella, Bella Pierre Cosmetics, um, but I haven't tried anything from them. And it was, an, um, they had a light, lighter kit and a medium kit, and I picked up the medium kit. And they have a BB cream, a high definition loose powder, a concealer, and a cream, a mineral, a uh, lip stain i suppose you can use it for your cheeks as well and this was only 7.99 the normal retail price is 65 pounds and i got it for 7.99 so yeah um i had to pick it up and because i haven't tried any bella pierre products this was a you know a nice way to try out their products and then from Too Faced during the Black Friday sales, I picked this um, palette up. It's the Too Faced You Drive Me Crazy. Look how pretty this is. Look at these donuts. My girls are in love with this packaging. They actually think that there's donut inside. Bless them. They're kids. Um, and then when you... Um, so the reason why I actually bought this palette because the palette comes with eyeshadows and four blushes and it also comes with a mascara, a travel size mascara and a eyeliner and this was with 20% off I paid something like £34 or something. Usually it retails for more than £40 I believe and I... I haven't tried any of the Too Faced blushes, so this way 
this was this was a nice way to try out their uh, cheek products as well as their eye products so there you go and then um, the mascara and the eyeliner is inside um, the box but it's the it's their famous one the Too Faced Better Than what is it I'm not, sh I'm not even sure it's that one basically you can see it here and uh, what else and that is it I believe so yeah I hope you've enjoyed watching this video so it was I was kind of all over the place but because because I haven't filmed in a, such a long time and yeah I'm gonna go and I'm gonna drink a big fat glass of water because my mouth is just drying out okay guys take care bye